Yeah, I guess this is kind of the first time that I really get to engage with people um, who are Star Wars fans as one myself and someone who's had to be very tightly sealed about the show for a couple years now. So to be able to finally celebrate together means so much to me. Well, I did a lot of fight training. Um, I got to set about six weeks early to start my fight training. And in the stunt gym is really where all of us got really close. It really is a kind of universe that just immerses you in it naturally. I mean, there's just um, the practical sets, the amount of artistry and craftsmanship that goes into creating this universe. It's a massive machine and a massive piece of art that so many people contribute to. And so as an actor, it's just kind of a privilege for us to be placed in the middle of it and try to service our characters the best that we can. Yeah, it feels great. I mean, they blocked the street off. Uh, a lot of people and it feels exciting, yeah. One of my sons is really knowledgeable, so I would ask him all the questions. Um, and then, of course, just with the showrunner, with Leslie, just like going deep into the character and doing a lot of the training for the action was really informed a lot of what I did. Yeah, she's great. Leslie's really, really talented. And she's such a good, a great storyteller. She's such a good director, such a good writer. So I was really excited to work with her. Uh, uh, Hollywood에서 하는 레드 카펫은 제가 처음이라서 너무 떨리고 그런데 uh, uh, 더군다나 스타워즈의 레드 카펫이다 보니까 어, 글쎄요 뭐 오늘 처음 이제 이제 공개를 하게 되는 이 시점이라서 더 떨리고 더 흥분되고 더 기대가 되고 그렇습니다. Um, so it's actually uh, my first Hollywood red carpet, and of course it's for this incredible franchise, Star Wars. So I feel very nervous, but excited, and this is the first time the show will be revealed, so I'm really looking forward to it. Uh, Kijana, um, when I put on my costume and uh, hair and makeup for the first time, I really couldn't believe it. And when I stepped onto set, I was really taken by the scale and the level of detail of the set. And I felt like it looked so realistic because it was all built practically. And it really allowed me to act in a way that was very natural. And it was very easy for me to focus on my role. Uh, 왼쪽 팔이랑 이렇게 자꾸 어, 닿게 되더라고요. 그러면은 이제 그 액션 팀이 오셔서 너 지금 방금 전에 왼팔 어, 왼쪽 팔 날려 날라갔다고 <웃음> 그 얘기를 자꾸 해주셔가지고 아 제가 습관적으로 자꾸 안쪽으로 돌리는 습관이 있구나 하면서 뭐 재밌게 좀 웃었던 그런 상황이 있었습니다. Yeah, one thing that happened um, during the lightsaber training was like a habit. I kind of would brush against uh, my left arm, and my trainer would tell me, oh, you just cut off your own arm. Um, so I realized, oh, I kind of have a habit of turning it inward, so I can't really do that. <laughs> Oh, it's so exciting. I'm honestly ecstatic. There's so many people. There's literally a whole row of people behind us, which is a little bit terrifying. Um, but I'm just, I'm really happy, and I'm so excited for everyone to see what we've made, and I'm just, yeah, I can't stop saying I'm so happy, but I'm just so happy. I had so much fun on this job. Everyone was lovely. I, I had such a wonderful experience on it, and I just hope everyone has, has a good time watching it as I did making it. I loved the stunt training aspect of it. It was so fun. She's truly one of the most wonderful people I've ever met. She's such a dedicated and generous director. She's so, she's so humble and she's so great at knowing who to listen to and when to listen and when to assert her status on people. And, and she has such a clear creative vision and she's such a fan and a lover of Star Wars. So it kind of felt like the perfect person to be making this. I mean, this is crazy. I haven't even really gone off to the other side to see how many fans are here, which is blowing my mind. So many people are dressed up. It's very, very, very cool. And this is, you know, I 
I came to see Star Wars for the first time. My father brought me. Star Wars is such a generational piece. It's a generational, I don't know, culmination of so many worlds coming together. I feel so honored to be in this position right now, getting my own kind of moment with it. It really is, it's incredibly special. You know, we had an, an amazing, I mean, many of them here, amazing group of excellent supportive team, crew members, designers, creatives. So every time we'd walk onto a set, anytime we put on a costume, anytime you'd pick up a prop, it was so easy. You know, you do your work as an actor, but being able to let it go and be living in the environment is an important part. Having the support of incredible people around you makes it so easy. And we had that hands down, hands down, back and forth. Oh man, I, I was lucky enough to work with Leslie before this, and I knew going into this, I had the, I, the lucky position of knowing that I could trust anything and anywhere that she led us. Um, I had an easy, laid back, kind of like mental, I don't know, a a adventure in, in building this because I knew how incredibly brilliant she is. Sorry, she's standing right next to me. Um, I mean, beyond the, the way that she builds these characters, so diverse, uh, balanced, you know, you see in a line where they are, where they've gone, where they are going. That's brilliant, that's brilliant structure. Um, and to apply it to something that's so fun like this, you don't get that opportunity. You know, they don't trust people in that way to take an IP like this that has so much history and build it in the right ways with a person who's a playwright, who knows how to really tell a story. So I'm really honored to be with her in this whole adventure, yeah. It's super exciting. I'm really excited myself because I've not um, I've not seen any footage of the Acolyte, so it's my first time, and to be able to sit in front of an audience, especially with some fans in the crowd as well, I think that's got to be a good introduction to seeing it. With this show in particular, it's very practical, um, so it's very easy to become submerged in in the scenery, and also I've grown up with Star Wars, so it already feels very familiar and um, super super exciting. Oh my god, it feels electric. I'm so excited for the world to finally see it. I just want people to get their eyes on it because we've been just like keeping it shrouded in secrecy and finally we can talk about it. It's beyond anything I, I could have imagined and, and that's just the real thing. And uh, you know, the first time that you step on a set, it's just like, oh, I'm in Star Wars. You know, it's like, it's indescribable. I'm so excited. It's like, it's daunting to be a part of something that's so big, but it's also really, really exciting. People will get to experience what Leslie Headland has magnificently created. And yeah, I it's it's a new era, new timeline, new characters, new stories, and I think people are gonna dig it. Yeah, I mean with Leslie, she has a very specific story in mind with um, like the murder mystery aspect. You know, on top of the murder mystery you have all the lightsabers, you have the Jedi, um, but it's really grounded in this um, story that she wanted to tell. Being able to take it back to the original trilogy and, and really just experience the, the puppeteering, uh, the, the creatures, the, um, the smells and sounds of a practical set, uh, it became just another character in, in all of our scenes. So yeah, it was very, very important. We were very fortunate to have that. Uh, there's a lot of energy. I know I was about to look full over on the carpet because I was like, how do I hold all of this? I mean, it's a lot. Um, so exciting. I can't wait to, I've seen the show, but I can't wait to see it with an audience. Um, it's just such a spectacular moment for all of us, so. It was unbelievable. I, I, working on the set, like just seeing the sets in person was mind-blowing. I felt like a child in the fantasy world, you know? It's just, I think it's the greatest dream uh, of a person to end up in that universe. Well, when you love the universe, it's just having fun. Um, it's just being able to rewatch stuff, studying them when I was putting together my fight sequences and stuff. And it's just, you just get to be a kid again, basically. You know, I think what's really great is that we're branching out into all these different stories and Leslie Hedlund is ushering in this new era of Star Wars and, and now we're seeing people lining up the, on the streets and seeing this soon on Disney Plus and we couldn't be more excited. Yeah, I think what's so amazing is that, you know, when people come into the Star Wars family and they know as much as Leslie does and they're steeped in, in all the lore, that's what was so exciting working with her. She had such a clear vision about what she wanted to do. 
You know, I think this was the golden age of the Jedi, and they're going to get a chance to see that. So, very exciting. I mean, it was the, it was really the amalgamation of just years and years of loving Star Wars. Um, I think the way I felt when I got the job was I had to shoot my shot. I, I had to put everything into it. I had to put all of the love that I have for the franchise, but also all of my own uh, personal experience, um, the things that I find uh, compelling and exciting about storytelling, um, good and bad, and how you can see yourself as the bad guy and there's still good in you, and you can see yourself as the good guy and there's still a little bit of bad. And that's something I hoped to imbue into the story. Oh, it's amazing. We've been working on this for a few years and we're all such a great time making it, so it's really fun to celebrate with everybody and finally show everybody what we've been working on. Yeah, I mean, Leslie is so unique because she knows Star Wars so incredibly well. And when I first met her, she already had like a very distinct idea of what she would want to do inside Star Wars, and it was very personal to her. So it really grabbed me like right away. Oh, well, I, I've been a fan of Star Wars uh, since the beginning. So I feel like it was my chance to really contribute to this huge universe and just take people to that galaxy far, far away in a way that makes them feel like it's the Star Wars they know and love and yet can, um, can be ready to hear the stories of all these new characters. It's a huge job to take on a project of this size and I just felt really supported um, and I like a true collaborator in the experience. They can look forward to feeling like they're in the world of Star Wars that they know and love, but also um, there are parts of it that are there are parts of it that are romantic, parts of it that are terrifying, and I just hope they appreciate hearing all these different dimensions within the Star Wars universe. All the sets were built practically, everything coming together: the look, the robes, the lightsaber. It really, really helped to play in that world, you know, that you could reach out and touch the puppets or the actual Jedi temple. It was, uh, it was, it was amazing. Yeah, I mean, her vision for the show was extremely unique, is extremely unique, and, you know, as a fan, she, uh, I don't know, she just knows, so, she has an encyclopedic knowledge of the world, and so she was able to build this world with masterful storytelling, really understanding the, the galaxy, the universe, you know. Do you know, for me, the, the, the thing that I'm really excited about is the action in the show. I think the action is phenomenal, truly a character in the story.